Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Ferreira here. I hope that you are all doing well. Well, I couldn't go for my break without listening to this, could I? So Philip has dropped a bomb on us. <laughs> As if that Christmas concert wasn't enough, this is the way he wants to close off this year. What a busy year it's been for him. Complex, all of the SB19 activities, moving closer, and now this. Now, I was going to watch the lyric video, however, he's already dropped the music video and it's English subbed, so I'm just going to watch this. I am so looking forward to this. So the title of this song is Kanako, and the Bisayan translation to English means me, to me, or myself. I don't know the genre of this. I know nothing else. I have well and truly tried to stay away from social media, so I don't get any spoilers, but I wonder if it's going to be him like wrapping up his thoughts and his feelings for this whirlwind of a year. Shall we find out? I'm so, so nervous. <laughs> It's a rock song. It kind of sounds like one okay rock. Really not what I was expecting from him. I mean, definitely he's wrapping up all of the experiences he's had, perhaps not even just this year in his entire career. And I just feel incredibly proud and really, really emotional over this. I feel so protective over him as well. And this is just him showing us another, yet another side to him. This sounds very much, this is like rock music, obviously, but it does sound like J-rock specifically. And I just love it. I love the diversity he's shown us this year. He's shown us that any Thing is possible if you believe in yourself and I'm just so so proud of this like what do I even say <laughs>
honestly not what I was expecting from him at all. I mean, it's for sure a worship song. You could directly link it to your thoughts about God and about being saved and always being by your side. But actually, it could also be for 18. And I think that's why it made me cry so much, because... I think that obviously he believed in himself from the beginning, which is why he took all those risks and just made this work, made his dream work, despite everything being against him, really. Um, but the fact that 18 have been able to give him the life that he now lives, and he's so incredibly grateful for it, and he gets a lot of negativity, he gets a lot of hate for somebody that is so loving and that is so cute and sweet. He gets a lot of nonsense from people, and it's pure, pure jealousy. Now, I really have nothing else to say about this apart from it's so, so beautiful. I adore this song and I think that it instantly goes all the way up to almost the top of my favourite song list from him because it's just so heartfelt and I really, really appreciate that he took the time in this crazy busy year to give us this and I truly believe that he likes to be busy. He likes to be in this whirlwind. He doesn't want this to end. I know he said that he's future-proofing himself by working this hard, but I really don't think that he can sit still. I don't think that he can stop. He's not one of those people. This is his love language and he is giving back to us through his music, his passion, and he's telling us, look, everything that you invested in me, look at what I'm giving back to you. He would never, ever disappoint me and I will never be able to repay him for the happiness that he has brought me this year and I look forward to spending many more years supporting this incredibly insanely out of this world man um and i've said it time and time again i say it in sb19 videos in philip videos but i also say it in other videos but if you don't know if i'm talking solo artist philip is my number one he is everything that I love in this world, in a voice, in a personality. He is my number one solo artist. And what a wonderful Christmas gift. And I'm so grateful that I got to listen to this before taking my break because I am going to be listening to this so, so much. Philip, I am so grateful that you keep going with this positive can-do attitude. You don't let any of the noise or the hate get to you, that you are so earnest in your prayers, in your worship to God. You are so good to your family, which we have seen over the past couple of days with his sister's wedding, um, that you are so good to us, that you are so good to your members in SB19. I am so grateful to have come across you, and what a gift. Talk to me about this song. How does it make you feel? It makes you feel worthy, doesn't it? It makes you feel like he's really thinking about you, which is really interesting. And I've said this, that the relationship that SB19 have with 18, I already think is so incredibly special. But then you put something like this on top of it, where they're directly giving songs to us. It just, this is a whole other feeling. What a bubble I'm going to be living in with this song. And I'm so sorry for being an absolute mess, but this attacked me out of nowhere. <laughs> Thank you so much for listening to this with me and for putting up with all of my crazy shenanigans, SB19 related. I have had an amazing year. All thanks to 18 and to SB19. And I look forward to many more years together. Thank you so much for watching this with me. I hope that you had fun. And until I see you next time, have a wonderful Christmas and New Year. Stay safe. Take care. Bye.